Well, now it's time for Talking with Joe. Joe Rose is live from the WQAM studios this morning. Good morning, Joe. Happy Tuesday. I don't know if you watched this, but the Home Run Derby Thank took you. place last night, and Bryce Harper was a big star of the night, winning the Derby at his home park. The now, this guy is used to putting on a show, whether it's his bleach blonde hair or his antics, but what a show by him, 19 home runs. Well, I tell you what, Bianca was impressive. He was way down in the final round with a minute left. He just hit so many home runs so fast. How about this? Nine home runs in 47 seconds for the big comeback and win 19 to 18. He got a rhythm going it there. It looked like he had no chance to win, and all of a sudden, he was hitting them, and he was hitting home run, home run after home run before they were even hitting the seats out in right and right center. Just very impressive for the comeback. Of course, he was at home. And how about this? His father was pitching to him. Some really cool stories coming out on a guy that's really struggled with a batting average but showed a lot of power last night, giving something back to his home fans. That's awesome. Well, his dad did play such a big role in, you know, him being the baseball player that yeah. he is now. Uh, but right. speaking about the all-star break, you know, we reached that, you know, break in Major League Baseball. We knew the Marlins wouldn't be contenders, right. but at 41 and 57, uh, Joe, give me a grade for this team at the halfway mark. Uh, for what they lost and where they are, I, I give them a, a C to a C plus. They've actually been very competitive. I know for, for our fan base, we want winners. But considering what they lost, uh, they've had some real nice stories. They've developed some guys. Actually have got a winning record over the last month. So they've done some good things. They're just, you know, so far behind, and it's disappointing for a lot of people. But, hey, JT Real Muto being the all-star game tonight has been a great story, maybe the best catcher in baseball all around for what he's been able to do. Anderson has proven that he's got a chance to be a star in the major leagues, both a right field and a third base. So there's been some really nice stories with this team. Just not enough to get this fan base really juiced up this year. Oh, Joe. Well, you know, C's get degrees. So <laughs> we're trying to keep it positive there, Joe. Yeah. Always good talking to you. Hey, and you we'll know talk what? to you in the next hour. Hey, Bianca. What? Bianca, I would have taken those C pluses in college. That, that's not a bad grade, you know. I know. C plus ain't all bad. You know, you tell your kid, when you get a kid that's kind of a dummy, I remember mom and dad used to go, just get C's, man, please. Just get some C's, knucklehead. I go, all right, mom, I'm working on it. So uh, I remember those days. They do get degrees, Joe. We're proud of you. All right, Bianca. Anyways, we'll talk to you the take next Take care. Hour. You take care of yourself.